Hello and welcome to LearnWire. In this video, we're going to be optimizing an old post on our site using Neuron Writer. Uh, that software um, has been out recently on AppSumo. I've done some videos on that. I've done a, a review video on that and made some other content. And then if you check out my last video, I actually show you how I used Neuron Writer uh, and ranked content very quickly using it. Now we're gonna go in and start and continue the optimization work to see if this, uh, what these triggers actually tell us, right? So here I'm in my trusty old uh, Excel spreadsheet that I'm keeping track the best that I can as far as what AI content writer I used for that piece of content and so forth. Uh, where, where I got the keyword from, you can see right here I got all my keywords um, so far right here from Rank IQ. Um, and then right here, this is actually the current rankings right here for this keyword. So it's affiliate programs that pay daily. And you can see it gets some really nice uh, search volume. And right now we've just moved up uh, five spots. So, um, you know, this is one of those things you need to decide for yourself. Should you be messing with your content if it's still kind of indexing and uh, Google's still trying to figure out where it wants to rank this content? Um, so I would probably not mess with content that is still climbing like right here it climbed five spots today uh, maybe not messing with it but we're going to go ahead and do it anyways um, but right now the latest is 20 the best is ranked 19 we want to get on page one right we want to get in that top 10 not on page two so what we're going to do is you actually uh, come through here and i have a neuron writer a uh, score uh, column right here and these right here I want to focus on so this one in particular is affiliate programs that pay daily I wrote this in Brainwork and Outranking we're going to finish the writing and uh, we're going to do a lot of manual optimization now at, but to this step and you guys are going to see that uh, but anyways you can see that we don't have a good score we're only about halfway there of where we need to get um, this uh, article hit the ground running ranked around page five is what it looked like and now I'm tracking page two but I want to go to page one so we need we're gonna optimize all these with uh, neuron writer but today we're gonna focus on just this one so let's go into neuron writer and look at this piece of content so we're in neuron writer and you can see that we have our piece of content right here 21 best affiliate programs that pay daily i already have the content in here i actually copied this and pasted that onto the site right i'll pull that up real quick for you guys and you can see uh, this is what it looks like live on my site and it's pretty dull there's no images there's no internal or external links and we're ranked on page two pretty cool stuff this also shows you that ai content really can rank um, if you do, you know, I did spend a lot of time putting this together, even using AI um, content. So the trick is, is that you still want to put a manual touch uh, to what you're doing with AI. Um, generally speaking, if you just let AI write and then push publish, it's probably not going to do too well. You do want to uh, manually go through it, proof and edit it. Um, and then also these list posts um, work really, really well. Um, and the AI writers don't really do that good with these list type posts. So um, you, I mean, it does do good, but you need to go in and assign all the numbers and, uh, and just spend some time cleaning it up, right? Uh, and so that is what it looks like. We're going to go and optimize this. So you can see that we're already over the word count. So we don't really have to worry about writing more content. But uh, naturally, we're going to be writing more content because we have a lot of terms. Uh, anything that's in black right here are, are opportunities to add. Anything that's in green is good. Um, red is uh, over-optimized for. Um, but you can also come over here to this checkmark box to see what your spam score looks like. Keyword stuffing risk. Um, we're at zero right here. But this, if this goes up, then that's telling us that there are, is some keywords in here that we probably need to dial down and so forth. So what we're going to do here is uh, we have a 34, but something that I learned uh, recently uh, from you guys is I need to get in the habit of uh, taking the title and going and filling out the meta description here, and it will instantly increase my score over here. Just give it a second. It'll automatically increase. So we're already at a 52 just by adding the title, but you can see we're still pretty far off from the top 10. And then right here, we can go ahead and fill in our description, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I just uh, put something together real quick. 
And there you go. Um, we'll optimize that. And uh, we're at a 58 just by filling that out. And as you can see, we're still um, underscore. And that would make sense because uh, technically speaking, we're ranking on page two and our content's just not good enough to get on uh, the first page be and could, because even with filling out the meta description, we're still, um, down about what, six points or so. So I'm going to go ahead and always just push save after I do things. I think it auto saves, but, um, you can never be too careful, but then I want to go and check what is our um, actual chances of ranking for this. It is a keyword difficulty of 12. So not too bad. I like 15 or less. Um, and we're going to come through here and actually I want to update these. The domain authority is what I really like to look at. So we're going to go and update these real quick. We are going against niche pursuits. So I'm going to go ahead and push the reload button on that. Okay. So now we came back and it does have all the, um, the domain authorities. We're at 51, 50, 46, 33. So we do have some opportunity I'm seeing right here. We have a 22 right here. Okay. And they have a content score of 65. So we, we have some work to do. Uh, so we have, um, but my site, I believe the, the the domain authority of my site is a 29. So I should be able to take out this site right here. And uh, this site right here is very optimized with their content. So there is a correlation of some sort because they only have a DA of 16, but their content is 75. And it's actually the highest scored on the page, but they have the lowest DA on the page. So um, there could be a correlation to their content being very, very optimized and very good. And that's why they have a top 10 spot. But we should be able to outrank one, two, uh, three sites. And then there's a lot that are in the low 30s that I could also. So I'm seeing enough here that there is definitely a chance to get here in the top 10 and possibly the top five. Uh, when we look at the uh, word count over here, um, I want to look at that one over here. So they have over 3000 words right here that they're, um, that they're, that they have on their site. So we could also use more content. That's telling us that the, the higher content is ranking really well. Um, uh, but this one only has 700, 700, um, word count on the page. They don't even have a very high domain authority and they don't really have the most optimized content. So this is kind of a, an interesting one that they're actually ranking um, for um, not a very high page authority and no uh, backlinks. So very, sometimes it's just really hard to identify why this site is ranking right here, but we can definitely do better than them, right? So now I have enough. I'm convinced that yes, we should be able to make it to the top 10. Let's go in and start optimizing, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start uh, coming through here and seeing which keywords right here that I can actually add in here, right? So um, add cracks, um, affiliate network, we can come in here, we can push return, write a kind of a new paragraph and just say, uh, this is a great affiliate marketing network, right? So affiliate marketing network, this should turn, um, this should re register that affiliate marketing network affiliate marketing network. It wants it one to two times and it just turned green, right? Um, and our score actually jumped to 59 right there, but we're not done with the sentence, right? We can keep optimizing. Uh, this is a great affiliate marketing network. If you want to get paid daily, so get paid daily surprisingly was not used in all of our 2,600 words. Um, and it, the, the, the neuron writer is telling us we need to use that. And we just did. And this turned to green right here. So we just turned both those two green, um, and we can keep going. Okay. So just by writing a extremely optimized sentence right here, we took this from a 58 to a 62. Look at all the different keywords I used in here. Uh, and this is just completely turning green. We're almost at that top 10. I'm going to spend a little bit more time in here and we'll come back. Um, and then we're also going to, um, add images, right? So there's some different places that I want to get images from. We'll probably go to the site to see. And that is one thing that I wish that they would add in here is how many images that do we need? Uh, what is the average images right on these sites? Um, I wish that this button right here, I wish they had another button right here that just said, Hey, you know, we recommend five images for this post. Um, or how many, what's the average images for the top 10 ranked? Um, that would be really, really cool. We're not seeing that, but 
we are going to go and add some images. Um, now you can add an image in here, but you need the link to it, um, which I think um, six in one, half a dozen in the other, we could add the link from like Unsplash or something like that. But um, it's usually better to upload it to your website so you don't lose uh, track of it. Um, if they change the link on the website and you use that in your content, then you're going to have a broken uh, image link, right? Um, and so we, I'm going to add probably about five images to this, and then we're also going to add some links. So I'll come back once we get this score up, but just wanted to show you how you can go and start tackling this. You saw that we came from a 34 right here live in front of you, and now we're already at a 62. I'm going to keep optimizing this. We'll be back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I spent all of 10 minutes going through here, optimizing what I could. I just picked a few of these that I um, am knowledgeable about and wrote about it. Pay Kickstart, I use this, um, and I'm an affiliate with Pay Kickstart, so I understand the program. So I wrote a couple of sentences on there, adding in some keywords where it was relevant. Then I did that with JVZoo, uh, very familiar with that program as well. Um, and by doing that, spending some time manually creating that, our content went up. And then I'll look at our score, we're at a 68 right now, we're well over the top 10. Um, I'll push a save up here. We're real close to that top one as well. There's a lot of them that um, are over 70, but right here, I think this is good enough to break into the top 10. All these ones that are in green, we are not gonna be able to, uh, we, we can't be surprised if we don't outrank them, um, but that's one, two, three, four, that's four. So uh, theoretically, we have outranked even the 65 right here. We should be able to break the uh, the top five. One, two, three, four. We should be able to break the top five, get number five with this content. I will update you guys uh, later on. What I would do with this is I would take this content now. What That's what I'm going to do is copy this. I'll go into my back end and I'm going to add a few external links into the article. I'm going to add a few internal links, a uh, reference uh, to backlink uh, within my site. And then I'm going to add about five images. So that's going to take another 15 minutes of work. And then this post right here will be uh, fully optimized. Um, I'll come back in over here and I'll just make a note. And I'm just going to say updated uh, post uh, 7, 18, 22 in, in Neuron should break top five is what I'm kind of, is what my goal is anyways, right? So just a note that you can come back to, and I'm just going to push save to my spreadsheet and so forth. So you guys hope, I hope, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe to LearnWire so you get more updates like this. I'm really going to be uh, going in deep with SEO uh, going forward. Uh, with content generation. I'm also going to be hiring writers. I'm going to be continuing to use AI to write content. I really want to take this site. It is growing and I want to take this site uh, to finally get 10,000 visitors a month to this website. And then of course, um, the big goal is to get to 50,000 page views per uh, month so then I can get approved to Mediavine and so forth. So uh, that is it for this video. I'll see you in the next.